Welcome back, Classic Gamers, and thanks for viewing Jay the Classic Gamers. Let's play Renegade for the NES. A loyal viewer of my channel named Full Metal Coyote asked me to LP Renegade for the NES. So this one's for you, buddy. I remember a kid up the street had this game when I was growing up, so I've played this game a lot. So with that said, let's get started. And right off the bat, with little time to react, you're thrown right into the action. Start kicking some ass. You can punch and you can kick in this game, but what I always liked to use was the jump kick. You execute the jump kick by pressing both the A and the B buttons at the same time. Ah, these assholes keep tag teaming me. Haha, ah, you missed. Now take that. Oh yeah, it's the P. Now it's time to kick the enemy across the screen. You want some more of this punk? After you defeat all the enemies on the screen, the subway door will open and you enter. Now it's time to kick some more thugs and punks ass on the subway. Who are you trying to sneak up on, bitch? I just have to say this, I love the music on this stage. In my last video, I was the badass vigilante. Now I'm the kick-ass renegade. After you defeat all the enemies on this screen, the subway doors will open and we will face our first boss, Jack. And Jack ain't jack shit. Just keep jump kicking his ass. There is a trick you can use against Jack. If you can get him close enough to the edge and kick him off, he will instantly die. But let's not use that trick. Let's kick his ass the old-fashioned way. Oh shit, this is gonna hurt. You want some more of this, Jack? Get your ass up! And just like that, Jack is defeated. And now we see our hero, Mr. K. The K stands for Mr. Kick-Ass. You ain't tough enough for me! Here we are on the second level, kicking some Asian motorcycle gang's ass. Oh, you bastard. Take that, bitch. You want some too? Hiya! Oh, you prick. I'm gonna get revenge for that. Aha, you're dead. Oh yeah, another P. Time to send him flying. Oh, you bastard. Now I must kick your ass. Take that. You want some too? You die. Jump kick you in the face. Jump kicks for the win. And after you defeat the last enemy on this screen, you will be facing some dudes on motorcycles. Just jump kick them off their motorcycle. Hiya! Hi oh, you bastard! Take that! Hiya! And even though his motorcycle blows up, we go ahead and ride it anyway. Now we go to a stage where we're kicking people off their bikes. I like this part a lot. This reminds me of Road Rash. Hiya! You want some too? Hiya! Oh, you get some too! Hiya! After you defeat all the guys on the motorcycles, we face our second boss named Joel. And he's pretty easy to beat. Just jump kick him in the face. I am whooping your ass, Joel. You are no match for the renegade, Mr. Kickass. Now I'm gonna mount him and give him a little ground and pound. Take that, bitch. Mr. Kickass says. You ain't tough enough for me. So here we are on the third level, fighting some bitches who swing purses and whips at you. Use the same strategy, jump kick their ass to death. Come get you some bitches in pink dresses. You know I how I feel about pink bitches. I hate pink bitches.
Ah, I will jump kick both your asses at the same time. Oh yeah, it's the P. Time to send these bitches flying. Damn, how many of these bitches are there? They just keep coming out of the woodwork. Alright, there's only two of them left. And after we defeat these two, the bar door will open. Now let's go inside the bar and kick some more ass. I think it's funny how the bartender just sits there and stares as I'm beating up all these bitches. He knows better. If he came out from behind that bar, I'd kick his ass too. Oh shit, that bitch hit me with her purse. How you like these jump kicks, bitch? Take that and die. Aha, there's only two more left. And after you defeat the last two enemies, we will go on to the final stage. Stage four. Mr. Kickass says, You ain't tough enough for me. So here we are on the final stage, and we have to beat up some more punks and thugs. So come get you some. Jump kicks for the win. The last stage is a maze level. It will give you different options to go into different doors. You must take the right doors in order to find the final boss. Haha, you missed. Take that. Oh yeah, power-up time! What's up, punk? You want some of this? Damn! He knocked my ass down three times in a row! Take that! You take some of that too, bitch! Quit ducking my jump kick, you asshole! Alright, so there's only one more thug left. Let's whoop his ass. And after you whoop his ass, you can go in the left or right door. Let's take the right door. In this room, we will have to beat up three thugs, so let's whoop that ass. There goes one of them down. Oh, and the second one down. Oh, you're all by yourself, asshole. You're gonna get your ass whooped. And after we whoop the last thug's ass, let's take the left door. In this room, we have to fight two Jacks. I know I said earlier Jack wasn't Jack shit, but now that we got two of them, this is going to be a tough battle. The strategy I try to use is to single one of them out and kick his ass first, then kick the other one's ass when he's all by himself. Oh, you asshole, I hate their jump kicks. But then again, they probably hate my jump kicks also. Oh yeah, power up time. Oh, he kicked my ass. Bam, take that. There we go, we killed one of the jacks. Now it's time to finish off the last one. After you defeat the last jack, go inside the left door. In this room, we have to jump kick two thugs off their motorcycles. After you defeat the two thugs, go inside the middle door. In this room, we have to jump kick three thugs off their motorcycles. Oh, you asshole, he keeps running me over. Finally, take that. Hiya. Oh, you want some too? Hiya. Oh, take that. After you defeat the three thugs, go inside the right door, and we will face our final boss, Babu. Watch out for this asshole. He'll pull out a gun and kill you with one shot. So stay real close to him and jump kick him until he's defeated. Mmm, how you like that? You want some more of this? I will whoop your ass. Oh, he kicked me, that asshole. And that is how you beat Renegade for the NES. So let's sit back and enjoy the credits.
This is a great NES beat em up game. I have fond memories of playing this game as a child, and I had a great time playing this game again. So this concludes Jay the Classic Gamers. Let's play Renegade for the NES. I hope you have enjoyed it. I want to thank you again for watching and thanks for the support.